we are on our way to the Odenwald forest in Hesse, Germany. First, we want to look at the so-called Magnetstein. These rocks are very special. They have been magnetized. This happened probably due to lightning strikes that created a magnetic field in the rock. This magnetic field is easily made visible by a compass that can be deviated to up to 30 degrees. You can practically feel their special aura by looking at them and touching them. And what a beautiful area they are located in. These natural wonders always make me feel small and very recent. We are headed to the Felsenmeer, or Ocean of Rocks, next. An amazing site full of giant dark grey diorite rocks that have been used through the ages by humans for various purposes such as making tools and in architecture. Most notably, the ancient Romans used the site to craft pieces of architecture such as giant pillars. These huge rocks are located on a hill they begin at the foot of the hill, giving visitors a spectacle already on the way to the Felsenmeer. Felsenmeer literally translates to sea or ocean of rocks. There is a legend surrounding our Sea of Rocks that two giants fighting created the structure. Both were casting rocks at each other. Most came down at the spot where you can see them till this day. According to some sources, one can still hear the defeated giant growling beneath the rocks. The site has developed over a period of 400 million years and is thereby much older than humankind. Here we have it, the giant pillar made by the Romans. One of close to 300 artifacts the Romans left at the site. The giant pillar was completed and still abandoned, probably due to faults in the material that made it impossible to transport it out of the site. Even with modern technology, it would be very difficult to move the artifact. So 
it remains at the site, having sustained multiple damages by humans over the years. It was awesome looking at this huge piece of art. Amazing how advanced the Romans were in creating and then also transporting such magnificent pieces. Unfortunately, we did not have much time left, so we could not show you the other artifact. We can really recommend coming here and looking at this special place with your own eye. We are glad it is still there for us to see and feel. It is completely open and free to explore. It should be treated with care and respect so it remains for future generations. Now, we will let you enjoy the rest of the impression in silence. 